What is good YouTube? It is your boy J Peso back with another video for y'all boys. And today, man, we're gonna be talking about why the gaming community is so trash. Garbaggio. Basura. <laughs> Hope y'all like the video, man. It's your boy J Peso. Let's get right into this video. Let me just start off by saying I am not trying to come at your favorite content creator or YouTubers or whatever because I don't want to beef with any of y'all bro. I am just speaking my mind about what I think the state of the gaming community is. I feel like people complain too much bro about everything. There's no content in the game, bro. The launch, it's, it, it's super buggy. When in all reality, you run into small, like, bugs and glitches. And, and some games are worse than others, of course. But every game isn't just completely terrible and it's just complete trash, bro. And it's just so garbage. Like, this is every review of damn near every game that I see. It seems like most popular opinions are negative. And all the games that come out nowadays aren't as good as the ones from from back in the day bro when they say there's no content that typically means i finished the battle pass in like three days because i i bought tears and i've no liked it for three days in a row you know 36 hours straight but we'll get more into that later so you're telling me that no game no recent title is like halfway decent that's cap and you know it we tend to look at old games with rose tinted glasses sometimes. And at times, I've, I've been guilty of that myself. But we just gotta be honest with ourselves, bro. A lot of the games that we played in the past, like, most of them may hold up today. But if they were, if they were to be released today, we'd pretty much overlook them. For the people saying that there's no content for games at launch, pretty much we're the reason why like there are battle passes in every single game that seems to be the standard across all games now because there just has to be something to unlock but speaking of the battle passes like the reason why a lot of people feel like there's no content is because you unlocked everything and finished the entire battle pass in three days because they played and they're good but also they're they're buying tiers so now there's nothing to do and it's just like, bro, that was like two months of grinding for a normal person. You know what I'm saying? Even if you're insane, some of the XP that you gotta gain, you, you shouldn't be able to do that in three days, bro. Yeah, it's not that games have a lack of content. It's people just no life the game. We don't play games for the, like for fun anymore because we enjoy the mechanics of the game. Like there just always has to be something to unlock, something to the flex to other players that you, you play the game, bro. And that you know you're you're a higher level than they are and stuff like that like why do why do video games have to be super goal oriented all the time we're playing video games bro it doesn't gotta be so serious about there has to be content in the game to grind for i still play halo man halo 3 after all these years there is no competitive scene none of that for halo 3 but i still play it because i enjoyed the game i enjoyed the mechanics of the game I enjoyed its simplicity, the nostalgia of it. You know what I'm saying? There's no objective, there's no, it's just, I'm just playing the game, bro, cause it's fun. Another reason why the gaming community is trash is the cheaters, the hackers, the people manipulating the game for their weird reasons. I don't know why. Like, first of all, we're playing a video game, bro. What are you cheating for? What are, what are you hacking for? What are you like, what are you doing any of this for, bro? especially like the hackers on like super old games like what do you get out of this it just it just screams loser and pathetic i'm sorry but it's just like why are you doing this this game is 15 years old bro you spend your time hacking these almost dead games bro this seems like weird activity i don't know why you would want to do that the last reason why the gaming community is buns is because y'all don't have a mind of your own Whatever is popular or whatever is giving positive reviews amongst popular streamers or content creators or whatever, it seems like games aren't considered good unless the big boys say it's good. And I'm just like, that's not always true, bro. Like, everyone's opinion is their opinion. 
You know what I'm saying? How do you even know, like, how do you even take what they're saying as just complete truth? You, you haven't played it yourself. You don't know if you'll find enjoyment out of things that people might not enjoy. We're all different. And we all, you know, are unique and, and have our own interests and, and dislikes and stuff like that. So it's like, you could listen to reviews with a grain of salt. But at the end of the day, like, if something looks interesting to you and you want to give it a try, go do that, man. But I don't even think that's just gaming. That's, like, life in general. You know, people tend not to do things that they want to do in life because it's not popular. It's not what everybody else is doing. Or it's look, it may be looked down upon. You might be looked at as lame or... Whatever notion, march to the beat of your own drum. I feel like everybody would be a lot more positive if they just lived the way they wanted to live. I know this video is about gaming, but it's kind of relatable to everything, you know what I'm saying? People tend to complain because they doing stuff that they don't actually want to do. When it comes to video games, it's like, bro, like, this should be fun. You should be enjoying playing the game. Like, I hear way too much complaining for y'all to be having fun. I don't know, I just, I just feel like the love for gaming just isn't really there no more. People kind of want to just be famous. You know, there's money involved. Like, you, you could blame the devs, you could blame the community of gamers. You could, you could blame a lot of things, but you know, play what I want. And if I find enjoyment out of what I'm playing, then that's what you're going to see, bro. Regardless of how popular something is, I'm not going to waste my, my time doing something that I don't want to do. We spend time doing things that we don't want to do already. So why do that when it comes to games? Just because other people say, oh yeah, this game is cool. Everyone's playing it, so just buy it. That's the reason why everybody's so dissatisfied with everything. Maybe that game that everybody, you know, said was garbage. Maybe you'll find a lot of enjoyment out of that game. Who knows? Like y'all, y'all put too much trust in the other people and their opinions. Do what you want to do. But y'all know what I mean though, man. At the end of the day, gamers, have a mind of your own. Cause it seems that everybody has the same freaking opinion on every single thing and it's always typically negative so like just think for yourself bro stop being a mouthpiece like be genuine but yeah man that's the video why the gaming community is trash put it in the garbage it's your boy zay peso and i'll see y'all boys in the next one peace